sometimes things don't turn out how we expect them to. These zookeepers put a couple of piglets in the same cage with a tiger. Many thought they would be devoured in a few seconds, but they couldn't believe their eyes when the tiger did this bizarre thing. Since the beginning of time, or as far back as we can all remember, we have been taught that tigers or any other big cats are super dangerous. The truth is, they are, but sometimes wild animals can surprise us in many ways. This is exactly what the big cat in this story did. A couple of years ago, a video from a Thai zoo went viral all over the internet. It was footage of a few piglets living in the same cage with a full-grown tigress. This odd arrangement started when the zookeepers at the Shiracha Tiger Zoo in Chonburi started an interesting project. They realized that some of the tigers in their care were notably unhappy. For some, it was because of injuries they had sustained while in the wild, and for others, like Sumai, it was the pain of a tragic childbirth experience. Sumai, the tigress, had lived in the zoo for many years. She was a quiet sword and she often kept to herself. There were days when she would interact voluntarily with the zookeepers and the other tigers around her, but mostly, she liked her solitude. Still, they could tell that she was content with her life at the zoo. After years of trying to get her to mate and have babies, Sumai surprised the zookeepers with wonderful news. She was finally pregnant. Seeing as the population of tigers has been drastically decreasing in the last decade or so, these majestic wild animals have become endangered. So you can imagine the joy in the zoo when they learned that Sumai was going to be a mom. These beautiful big cats gestation period lasts about three to four months, so the wait wasn't too long. Unfortunately, when the time came for Sumai to give birth, things didn't go as smoothly as they had all hoped. The delivery started out very rocky. After several hours, she gave birth to three cubs. Unfortunately, two passed away shortly after seeing the light for the first time. The third was alive for a few days, but all their efforts to keep it healthy and strong failed. It passed away in its grieving mother's embrace, following its siblings. The zookeepers could tell that losing her baby severely affected Sumai. She was thoroughly heartbroken. The big cat hardly ate, barely moved around, and nothing interested her. They realized that they needed an intervention if they wanted to help the tigress get her spark back. Around this time, the zoo was working on a project to help wild animals become more accustomed to their new lives in the enclosures. It also aimed at introducing prey and predators to one another in controlled environments to assess their reactions. They believed that the calmness of the smaller prey would help calm the larger, more ferocious animals. It was an unbelievable experiment, but they had studied enough to believe it could work out. They first decided to try it out with baby prey animals and female predators. Their premise was that the motherly instinct would kick in, and the predator would be kinder to the weaker, younger animals. And what better candidate was there for such a unique project than Sumai? The tiger had been mourning the loss of her babies for so long. They knew it was time to lift her out of her depression. In a pen just a few rooms away, a pig named Plea had just given birth to 12 piglets. The zookeepers came in and took Plea with six of her cubs to meet Sumai. At first, they didn't take the piglets into the tiger's pen. Instead, they let the mother pig and her babies watch Sumai from outside her cage, just like she had done with everyone who came to say hello. The morning tigress didn't bother to look up. Once, a long time ago, she might have walked over to them to investigate, but now she didn't even look their way. After a few days of this type of meeting, the zookeepers noticed that the depressed tigress started peeking at the piglets when they brought them by. By a week, she was already watching them with a lot of interest. It was the most engaged they had seen the tiger since she had lost her three cubs. Finally, they decided it was time to move the project to the next stage. One morning, they brought the piglets to the front of Sumai's cage like they used to. As she often did, she watched them with fascination from where she lay. Neither the piglets nor the tiger expected what would happen next. A few zoo workers came and picked them up. They opened Sumai's cage slightly and gently threw all six of them in there with the predator. At first, the tigress was startled and confused. 
The staff could see many questions in her expression and body language. The piglets, which were still young, didn't even seem phased by the whole thing. In fact, what they did next shocked everyone that was watching. One by one, the piglets started moving closer to the tigress. They were small and weak, but it seemed that they thought she was a safe haven. They all scurried towards her and began to cuddle by her side. Everyone watched in silence, wondering what Sumai would do. For the next few minutes, she just lay there frozen as six piglets cozied up to her. It was when one of the piglets climbed her back that she finally gave a reaction. The tigress surprised everyone when she started nuzzling the six little pigs. By the end of the day, the zookeepers could see that Sumai had easily slipped into the role of mom pretty quickly. She was herding the little piglets like she would her own cubs, and she even let them run around her. Seeing this was nothing short of miraculous, as news of the miracle tigress mom and piglet baby spread. Visitors came rushing in. The zoo was packed with people who wanted to see Sumai and her unusual adopted babies. First, we took the piglets away from their mother and then we left them with the tiger. Straight away, they ran to the tiger thinking it was their mother. One of the zookeepers explained to the visitors and news reporters that came to the zoo. For days after that, the zookeepers noticed a significant change in Sumai's mood and behavior. She was very eager to watch over her little piglet babies and care for them. They even put the six piglets in tiny little adorable tiger costumes. This wasn't to make them look more like actual tiger cubs, but because Sumai had hinted at something they didn't catch before. The zookeepers realized that the tigress was constantly cuddling with the piglets to try and keep them warm. It turned out that the room was a little chilly for them. The adoptive mom was giving them much-needed body warmth, like a real mother would do for her children. The experiment was a shimmering success for many reasons. First, these piglets were able to build an amazing and nearly impossible bond with the tigress. Each of them had a special connection with her that was admirable and obvious to anyone who came to watch them. Most of all, the project was a success because of the effect it had on Sumai. The tigress went from being depressed about losing her babies to being a happy mom. She no longer sat alone in her cage barely moving. Her unusual little ones always kept her positively entertained and busy, and after a few weeks managed to accomplish an incredible feat. To everyone's delight, Sumai healed from her depression and started interacting with other tigers in the zoo. It wasn't long before she started mating again, and less than a year after the prey and predator experiment, she gave birth to perfectly healthy cubs. Sumai was now a proud tiger mom to her own cubs and her adopted piglet babies. The tigress wasted no time introducing all her babies to each other. Videos of the tiger cubs and piglets playing together took over the internet. Once again, the tigress and her piglets were trending on social media and showing the world that the love of a family can heal all wounds. It's almost impossible to imagine that tigers and piglets would ever coexist happily together. Yet, somehow, this unusual group in the Thailand Zoo has managed to beat the odds. Had you already seen pictures of Sumai and her unusual litter on the internet? Do you think this experiment could work with other species of predators and prey? Tell us in the comments below. Thank you for watching and see you next time.